Hello, this is Dr. Valentine, and I just wanted to create a follow-up video to the testimony that you just saw. Uh, so many people around the country and even the world uh, actually are inquiring about our gastritis program, so I thought it was kind of essential before contacting us that you would have a little bit of uh, kind of familiarity with us and who we are, and uh, we are uh, practicing doctors of chiropractic that have um, interest in what we call functional medicine. And functional medicine means that what we're interested in is getting to the root cause of the problems. And that's exactly what this situation with gastritis. More and more people are developing gastritis type of problems because of uh, so many different factors. Uh, and that's what we really want to get to the root cause of what's going on with individuals like yourself. Uh, there is so many remedies and obviously you found us on YouTube and so you probably have gone through other different testimonials or other um, videos that you saw that you went ahead and kind of listened to them. I can only tell you that for us this has been something that we've been doing for over uh, 30 years and have been great success with and of course our, our patients uh, and other individuals that we've done telemedicine with have had great success. So when we look at uh, individuals with gastritis again we want to find out well why is a pit, why is the individual having these issues to begin with? Are they uh, suffering because there is digestive disturbances going on such as is there truly too much acid? being produced or actually not enough. And as you know, when you're taking things like uh, Tums or you're taking uh, Alka-Seltzer, you're taking a Meprazole, which is like a, what we call a proton pump inhibitor, all those are designed to do is uh, reduce acid production. Understand that acid production in our stomach is our first line of defense. So when we reduce it as a production, we are actually reduce, reducing our defensive mechanism because now that allows the bacteria, the viruses, the parasites, the fungus or yeast to really get into our body and take kind of uh, take hold in there and actually create more problems. So I wanted to educate you a little bit more on gastritis because not only do people have uh, problems as far as digestive disturbances or maybe pain, maybe upset, maybe uh, bloating, maybe issues with their, where they get some, uh, some bringing up as far as acids into their uh, chest area or into the throat area, but many times that they're going to have issues with sleeping. So sleeping is going to be a big time issue as well as mood. So there's going to be anxiety, which we see uh, quite often when someone is suffering from gastritis. Um, so what, we, what we'd like you to do is that if you're interested in this more, if you're interested in our protocol, then what we're going to do is create a next video and we'll give you some more information on gastritis and our program and what it entails. In the meantime, if you're looking, if you're not really serious, but you're kind of kind of on the on the border, you know what we call teeter totter, good good analogy. Then you might try uh, apple cider vinegar, for example. Take a couple tablespoons of that, put it in water, and drink it down. Now you could drink it down without food and see what kind of reaction. If there is increased burning. Uh, created, then we know that there is definitely irritation within the digestive system and you probably have inflammation which is redness. And you might have already under, undergone an endo endoscopy which is where they put a camera down into your throat to kind of identify that. Or you might have had uh, a stool sample and they've checked for H. pylori. H. pylori is one of the big things that is associated with duodenal ulcers and that is the, uh, that's part of the gastritis, gastritis picture as well. If you've been through those, if you tried those things and you still are, you know, suffering and you really, you know, are committed to getting well, then our program is probably something that would interest you. Um, in the meantime, try those and check out our next video, which will be, uh, we'll, we'll create a link to that. Have a great day and talk to you soon.